It's 3 o'clock time for the Hour of Mercy broadcast here on Annunciation Radio. Thank you for joining us. We'll begin this hour first with the recitation of the Divine Mercy Chaplet with your intentions included. If you have a prayer request, we'd encourage you to make the telephone call now. Speak with uh, producer Tim here who is ready to take your telephone call, write your prayer request down, and bring it into the studio for us to include today that telephone number to call, 419 Eight six eight two nine six six. Again, anything on your heart and mind, we'd love to include it as we pray today. Again, four one nine eight six eight two nine six six. Uh, you won't be going on the air. You just talk to Tim. Tim will write your prayer request down and bring it into the studio, so you don't have to worry about uh, being live on the air with your prayer request. Following the recitation of the Divine Mercy Chaplet today, we'll have Mass recorded this morning at Rosary Cathedral, the celebrant for today's Mass, Monsignor Kabaki. Following that, Sister Ann Shields in the program Food for the Journey, all coming up this hour on Annunciation Radio. First, as I said, we will begin with praying the Divine Mercy Chaplet. My name is Dave Vastris, joined by my wife, Eileen. Hello, Eileen. Hi, David. Hello, everyone. I know we've got some prayer requests to uh, begin with, so we encourage you again to add yours to it. Simply call 419-868-2966. And with that, we begin our prayer today in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I know you've got some prayer requests there, Eileen. Yes, Kathy is asking for prayer for Brian to heal so that he'll be healed. And with hope that he can return to work very soon. And for her brother as well, Michael, to return to the church. Mm. Okay. Father, th- we thank you. Thank you, Kathy, for your concern for, um, for Brian. We do pray for, uh, his recovery and, uh, his ability to work, to, uh, return to work. Father, you know what the need is. We just ask that you administer to him and his every need and his, uh, desire to return to work to continue uh, to provide uh, for those under his care. Uh, ask that you would walk with him, that you would uh, lead the way in this restoration of his body, uh, whatever the the issue that is causing him not to be able to work, that he might uh, be healed of that and brought back to uh, full capability to be able to continue the work that he had done. And we do pray for Kathy's brother Michael as well to return to the church Father, we lift up uh, the needs of uh, of Brian, as Kathy has asked, and the needs of Michael. One, praying for the healing of the body. The other, praying for the healing of the soul. And Father, we know uh, which takes precedence. So we would ask for full um, restoration for Michael, uh, that that he might return to the, the uh, faith of his youth, that he would rediscover the beauty of the church, uh, that whatever avenue, vessel, uh, you choose to provide for him. I know that there is grace already sufficient for him to return to the church, but that his heart might be moved to say yes to the invitations that are already there. All right. Alice has asked for prayer for the repose of the soul of Mark Thies, owner of the Pinnacle. He passed away yesterday. Yeah, and so some of you <clears throat> listening may be familiar with Mark and uh, Mark passed away yesterday, so we pray for the repose of his soul. Such a helpful man, and all of the um, all of the times that we were able to gather at the Pinnacle, not only for benefits for Annunciation Radio, but for so many other Catholic organizations in and around Toledo. Uh, Mark was always such a fabulous, fabulous supporter of all of us, and always did such a great job welcoming uh, welcoming us and providing such a wonderful facility and services. So, Father, you know, Mark, uh, we just ask that you would welcome him into your kingdom. Um, Know that this was a big surprise, shock, and just ask that uh, those who love him would be comforted during this time of loss and that by your grace and by your mercy, uh, you would welcome him home. And finally, prayers for the people in Southern California who are suffering through the results of Tropical Storm Hillary. Quite a bit of damage with that. And, of course, we've been praying for those in Hawaii and Maui as well. Yeah, so we continue to pray for all of those suffering from these disasters, obviously, for loss of life in Hawaii. We do pray for our brothers and sisters in Southern California 
I experienced in a tropical storm, something they don't uh, they don't encounter too often. So now we're hearing reports of mudslides and other things. And Father, just asks that you would keep all safe during this time. We do pray again for all of those in Maui who lost their lives, all of those who continue to look for loved ones. Just ask that you would be there to comfort them and to bring them peace. For these intentions, those that we have spoken aloud, we also invite, I also invite you to bring your own personal intentions before the Father's throne. And we pray, Father, for you to receive those spoken prayers and those unspoken prayers as we pray today. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. You expired, Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O font of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity, of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. 
for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Jesus, I trust in you. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us, that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself. St. Faustina, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for joining us for this recitation of the Divine Mercy Chaplet. If you have a prayer request that you would like to share with us at any time, please send that to us via email, chapletprayer at gmail.com, chapletprayer at gmail.com.